we've all had bad customer experiences. Agent, agent, agent. What is your order number? T as in toy. B as in boy. No, no, T as in toy, as in Twilio. Three? Hello? Yes, yes, I'm here. Thank you for your patience. You are now next in line. Wait, what? It doesn't have to be this way. We believe in building customer communications that feel natural, empathetic, and respectful. As my mom used to say, treat customers how you want to be treated. So then, what's good customer experience? Text with quick, actionable resolutions. Intuitive and personalized treatment over the phone. Hi, Alex. Is this about your recent robot order? Knowing when to bring that human element into the conversation. It seems like you need to speak to a specialist. I'll connect you now. I think we all know how to achieve this level of smart communication. Okay, I'll admit it. I did put AI in the title of this video because I knew people would watch. But I'm here to say that you can't just throw AI at your communication problems. AI is a useful tool, but on its own, it isn't the solution. When it comes to streamlining communications with a massive customer base, AI will only enhance their experience if it can work off a strong foundation of data and personalization. So let's break it down. Great customer experiences aren't built in a lab. They are built by getting out, mobilizing, and engaging with customers. And what is the biggest bit of technology that enabled human mobility? The wheel. As a tool, AI can help along every step of this customer engagement flywheel. Step one, data. And not just any data, the right data, ethically gathered from real customer interactions. You know, farm to table data. Who is the customer? Why might they be calling? Which starting Pokemon did they choose? You probably already know more than they think. And I always chose Squirtle, by the way. AI can help gather data in new and novel ways. It can generate insights from unstructured data, such as phone calls or chat interactions or can look at troves of past behaviors to try and predict pain points or understand product usage. A side note, no one wants Big Brother. We're not scraping browser history here. Just use what customers have already given you and don't ask for the creepy stuff. Step two, action. Use this data to do something valuable. Make the experience smarter, faster, or more delightful. When it comes to action, AI can be your first line of defense, helping customers get quick answers or support and freeing up your agents for the hardest cases. Or used properly, AI can make agents look like superheroes who have a ton of context about the customer along with institutional knowledge at their fingertips. Step three, customer love. Delight your customers and they'll keep coming back. And guess what that gives you? More data. AI can help reinforce customer love through hyper-personalization. Your AI can help you predict what your customers will do and how they want to be reached. So every interaction is the right message at the right time on the right channel. So here's the takeaway. AI isn't the solution, it's a tool. The real solution is understanding your customers, then using AI to build a better, more personalized experience at every touch point. Wear your customer shoes, metaphorically, Build the communications you would want to receive and keep the wheel spinning. But there's a problem, and it has to do with customer trust. Every year, Twilio conducts our state of customer engagement report. We ask both business leaders and consumers about how they're experiencing customer engagement, what's working and what's not. One finding from 2024 is a little concerning. 85% of businesses think AI will enhance customer engagement. Only 22% of consumers agree. That's a 63 point reality gap. Why? Well, agent, agent, aid, but there's reason to be optimistic. First, these numbers were from the end of 2023. And in AI years, that was like, what, 21 years ago? And I'm starting to see the tide turn. I recently spoke to Bob Summers, the CEO of Good Call AI and one of our Twilio AI startup Searchlight winners. He's been in the AI space for 15 years, going all the way back to his days at Google. I asked him, are people actually willing to talk to a machine? He told me that three years ago, their interaction rates were roughly 70%. Now it's in the upper 90s. So for every 10 calls picked up by a robot, three used to be instant hangups. Now it's less than one. Why the chain? Bob credits a few things. AI voices are way better. People are more familiar with tools like ChatGPT. Flows are more flexible and understand customer context. And the big one, personalization. 
Imagine a friendly, natural voice picking up and saying, Hi, Alex. Are you calling about the robot we delivered yesterday? That's when people stay in the line. That's when trust starts to rebuild. See what's happening? It's not just AI getting better. It's AI plus personalization that makes the difference. But let's be honest. There's another challenge. AI is evolving every day. Data management isn't easy. You want AI to help your agents and marketers not confuse them. And you need to know, is this thing even working? That's enough to stop anyone. But don't worry. We got you. Let me show you how Twilio can help. First up, Segment. Segment is our customer data platform. It helps you organize your data into a single unified view. You can use it to run personalized campaigns, automate messaging, and make your data actionable with AI. Next, Flex. Flex is our programmable contact center. It can integrate with Segment and any data source and deliver live AI-powered suggestions to your support team in the moment. Now, if you want AI to speak voice, check out Conversation Relay. Or if you want to build a full-on AI agent, we've got Twilio AI Assistants. They are updated regularly to include the latest and greatest in AI, so you're never left behind. Need to know how your humans and machines are performing? That's where conversational intelligence comes in. It monitors voice and messaging conversations, so you can keep your quality high, spot issues early, and fine-tune the experience. And finally, if you want help building any of this, we've got friends. Our marketplace has incredible partners like Bob Summers Good Call, who can help you build customer engagement experiences worthy of this century. So next time someone calls in, they won't have to yell agent. Maybe, just maybe, it'll be a robot worth talking to.